in this lecture we discuss about rectangle we find out the perimeter area and diagonal of a rectangle first of all see the definition of rectangle a figure formed in the plane by four non collinear points is called a rectangle if the opposite sides are equal in length and the angle at each vertex is a measure 90 degree let's see diagram of rectangle four sides of the figure and internal angle of 90 degree dry rectangle of length 4 cm and width 3 cm see this diagram its length is 6 cm which is shown horizontally and width is 3 cm shown vertically See another example. The rectangle of four centimeter. Here we have only one side. It means all four sides are equal. Length of all four sides is four centimeter. A square is a special type of a rectangle. We know that. if all sides of the rectangle are equal in length then it becomes a square now we find out the perimeter of a rectangle first see its definition peri means around and meter means measurement so we defined perimeter as round about measurement perimeter of a rectangle is obtained by sum of all of its sides in previous example we have length 6 cm and width is 3 cm so formula for finding perimeter is equal to 2 into length plus width length is 6 cm width is 3 cm so it's perimeter is 18 cm now we find out the area of a rectangle see the definition of rectangle area the area of a rectangle is the region occupied by the sides of a rectangle area of rectangle is equal to length into width if length is 6 cm and width is 3 cm so its area will be 6 into 3 is equal to 18 cm square now let's see what are the diagonal a rectangle have two diagonals which are line segment linking opposite vertices of the rectangle a rectangle is a parallelogram and the diagonal of rectangle are equal in length see the diagram in this diagram we have length 8 cm and width is 6 cm a b c d are its vertex AC is the diagonal of the rectangle which divides the rectangle into two triangles we find out the diagonal by pythagoras theorem which is 10 cm if you have any question you may ask in comments thanks for